Hey folks, welcome back to Manor Lords. Oh, that's right. That's what I was working on last time. <laughs> Actually, I want to try something different there. It was successful in Gimli because we had we ran a road at the top first instead of up the side. So, how best to do that? Let's take this road around. Like so. Let's tighten that up a little bit. And take you on out. Don't know how far. Okay. So, if we were to try that one more time. You and... Hmm. I think from here... Didn't like that, huh? That's a road. Okay, let's try it this way. House. No? That is a house. Where are my little dots? There are dots here. There are no dots there. Is that road broken? Interesting. See the white dots? What's... Oh, they showed up now. Was I in the middle? No. It's like the game just caught up. Maybe that was it. Okay, so from there to there. There we go. And then wrap you around. You don't want to wrap this time. Interesting, because there's no there's no dot at the end. Ah, okay. Uh huh. Okay, let's try another way. Let's come from here down. Shoot over to here. Now, interesting. So it's not liking that. So where's that last top dot? You are. Let's go back to house. There we are. So you are right there. So if I drop a road right here instead, like that, and try that one more time, then I will give up. You're to here, then you go up and snag that dot, and that allows me to arc around. At least, well, at least that far. If I just take you. Okay. I don't know. Anyway, I suppose that... It is not going to work well in this one particular spot. We will fight this battle later. Right now we're in April. What does that really mean? Uh, you want the forager's hut and the weaver's workshop wants space. Do I want to give them space? Um, let's check this way. Let's grab a... Where is our closest... There you are. Market area. Let's pin you, and let's look around. We could use more fuel. We could use a tiny bit more food variety. Not much, though. What is that? The logging camp requests a market stall. I think... I didn't know the logging camp had one. Wait a minute here. No. Somebody in the logging camp. I think it means from their own private house. Anyway, turn you off and go back to fuel. Where was the clothing? So, we are... We're hurting a little bit on clothing, and I'm pretty sure the 93, 96, and 91 means we don't quite have enough market stalls in the system to give us enough capacity for the number of houses. I think that is a thing. So let's go ahead and I guess allow those two. One more of food and one more of clothing. Fuel, probably not. So I'm going to ignore logging camp. I don't really know what that's about. Try that again. Logging camp requests market area for their stall. I'm pretty sure that's a house. So let's go and tell these houses not to uh, not to do it. And I think that will go away. Is there a third one? Looking around. I thought there was one right here. You are the original one. You three are off. Okay. So that should relieve the whatever is going on over here, which I assume means it's either this house, yeah, garden, or this house, not a garden. So probably the garden folks had wanted it, and they just happened to work at the at the logging camp. I think that's what's going on there. So you can go away, and let's give them a market space, and let's move on to somewhere else. So where are we? We're out over here. I don't see markets here. I do see one right there. It's a little one, and there are only two in this one. Well, there were three, so if I do that, demolish you, will one suddenly show up from one of those other two? I don't know. Any other abandoned ones? You are abandoned. So, firewood stall. So, if I delete these, I assume that frees up an empty space. Though, I thought they would destroy them themselves and 
rebuild. Um, I'm over here. These are good and these are good. So we added an empty space over here. No square is showing up saying they're building. And I lost myself here. Here. And you just... You're confused. <laughs> there was an abandoned stall here. It's gone now. I don't understand. Aliens took it. That's what it is. Um, let's just give them one more market space somewhere. We were going to be growing out this direction. So that kind of works for here. And we do get one more. And it's being built right now. Okay. So really just future proofing. So we were wanting to expand out on this curve. More housing out over here. Uh, clothing stall done. Great. So if I was... This is the farmhouse. This is a weaver shop. Um, farm. And stalls. Actually, right in here. I think right in here. So housing. Uh, marketplace. If I were to do something really funky... Uh, like that... That gives me two, even though it's not really going to show that way. That'll be fine. Pop you in, although it did take our nice little bushes away. Settlement level. Okay, I've been kind of waiting for that, though I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Um, that's good enough for Samwise? I think so. We have one over here. My original plan was to take these two. I took this one while I was waiting. And we had already taken this one, though I don't know if it's doing any good. We'll find out soon enough when we get all of these lambs in. We ordered eight more lambs um, over here, and we already had two sheep. So, trade. Still have two sheep, and now we're up to five out of eight lambs. So, two and eight will give us ten total. So, if we ever get an eleventh, it'll be because it, you know, we actually bred it. But I don't know what's happening there, but we're not getting any. And did you just finish? I think you did. I was really curious as to what was building over here. I guess I was too bad I didn't get to see it. He built this fence way out over here and built that stone structure kind of at a diagonal. I don't know what that was all about, but ooh, we get to look inside. Unassigned families over here. Well, give us a moment and we'll be bringing a new family in. Nifty. Oh, you just vanish. Oh, it's a portal to somewhere else. Oh, dude. That was quite a trick. <laughs> what are you doing? Transporting planks. That's interesting. Did they, like, tear down a, a scaffolding to build this and took the excess planks with them? That would be cool if it was it was capable of that. Um, points. Yep, I am, uh, I am, I am wandering here. Um... I was brought up to play with this one, fertilization, in the comments last time. Uh, allow to use fallow field as a pasture which rapidly restores lost fertility. In other words, it brings the fertility up faster than setting it as a fallow field. I wish it would increase fertility. In other words, take a plus one fertile area and make it a plus two fertile area because you've added all of the manure but it's just going to restore what's already there. And on this map, unfortunately, there's, um, there's, there's not much already here. So to make these fields, it's just going to, as far as I can tell, it's just going to keep us at a plus one, which isn't really worth growing them, isn't worth all the labor for a whole month or two months. This may be. This, I mean, this is definitely worth doing, and we'll, I'll make these a little bit bigger. We'll grab some of the plus one to mix with the plus two. Maybe make two halves out of this somehow. Get into here a little bit, and we'll get a little bit of yellow and green in there. And in that case, it might be worthwhile. We'll see. We'll see. Um, I would like to, even though this isn't our primary ore production uh, place. This does have, though, a rich iron deposit. It does. I would like to be making this here. We will eventually be making that over in Gimli. But for now, it would do us some good. Do we need to get into this? Is the game going to last long enough to go through 1500 iron? Each one of those is an iron ingot. Right? Does it say how much the bloomery uses for each iron ingot? Uh, bloomery, people, advanced, question mark, iron ore, 
into iron slabs. Does, if I click on here, I don't even get to move. Oh, there's iron ore, mining pit, iron deposit, clay. Where's my iron slabs again? Yeah. Close. Do that again. Iron slabs, I get nothing when I click on it. So, I'm guessing it's a one-for-one one thing. So that means we're going to be making potentially another 1,500 plus iron slabs. That's a lot of iron. Do I really need to spend a point there? I'm not convinced that I do. We have had food problems in the past. It would be nice to get into doubling our meat. And what does this do? Enable hunters to skillfully lay traps, which will give us passive income of meat. Okay. Um, if I could get into this one. Where's the one? No, I guess it's just it's just this one. It gives us potentially twice as many animals because they're breeding twice as fast, which also then gives us twice as much uh, um, leather or hides because we're taking down twice as many animals. So that's a that's a huge bonus right there, food wise. So this one is helpful, but it's not as good. The berries. Do we want to boost our food? Is what I'm curious about. Do we want to boost our food this way? Not necessarily get into these, but just to get another burst of food, another variety, to keep our variety up. There is that. Do we want to get into here, which is where I originally wanted to go? Reduces the foreign import tariff by half. So it's not as wonderful as it was before. Before I got rid of it. So now we're cutting it in half, which is helpful. Long term, it really is helpful. Now, oh, interesting. There's a question I had a long time ago. And I don't remember this being written this way before, so you tell me if it changed with that update. Import, a foreign import tariff, rather than just import tariff. Was it always foreign? Because I was always under the impression that if I traded between here and, and here, it originally would have been plus 10 for each trade, if I didn't take that one. Though I know now it, is, it, it gets rid of the tariff. And now I see the tariff is actually worded as foreign tariff so it deals directly with and only with these guys trade points from outside of the provinces there's a lot going on while i'm just sitting here babbling on so i'm going to pause while i'm talking what is actually happening we've got generic storage is full over here because you guys harvested is that what i'm getting right over here no generic storage over here as well and Okay, I'm a little confused here. Generic storage isn't having a problem with any of these. You and general now. So excess goods need to be moved to a storehouse, otherwise workers may stop production. There are no excess goods. Huh. I don't know what to make of that. I do know that you're supposed to be a tier 2. You're going to be made a tier 3. Let's pop that one in. And you two are going to be tier twos to be turned into tier threes. So that, yeah, we need three tier T, tier, yeah, bath, tier threes <laughs> to get to the next point. Which means we're going to need a bunch more tier twos to make up for that. We're going to need at least three more. And I just set two of them. So a third tier three. Vegetables seem to be a great place to use it because, you know, for the big vegetable yards because that gives us more families to take those fields down. Um, let's just randomly pick one more thing. We've got all these done. No, we're still building you. So that should finish you guys. And I'll let that run for a while. We have nobody to do the work anyway. Okay. Um, where can I pull one person just to keep it from getting angry at me? Um, how, are, how are the animals doing? Berries are doing okay. We put three families in there. You guys are taking them down pretty hard. So I think I'll go back to take one family out of each. You, you, and you. Okay. And that will free up some families to start working on those. All right. So where to spend this point? So this is worthless for us. So we're not going to get into there, even though it works for our sheep. You are interesting. You are not as powerful as this. 
And in my practice game, though that may have changed with the update, I had taken this just to watch it. I never saw another you know, ticking up of meat. When, of course, it's possible that I didn't see it because I was looking at this instead of looking at this. So it may have been ticking into the, into the stalls without me realizing it because I was looking at the surplus. So it, that may be the case. So I can't say that conclusively. Honey, oh, we did that over there. We did that over there. What does that mean? We've had some time in here now. What has happened with our honey? And we were supposed to be getting a lot more fields out here by now, and we didn't. All right, so people, we have one family in here, up to four families. If you know the answer, what does additional families in the apiary do? Is the amount coming in proportional to the amount of people that are running it or what I mean does it start popping more of these hives out here or graphically it stays the same but the but the uh, the output ramps up anyway um, getting into let's go total honey 35 so 35 honey and get out of total we still have 12 so we're satisfied with 12 extra so the honey's working um, we need another perk if we want to get the wax out of it too, but the honey is giving us a variety and there's enough of it to have maxed out our needs and still have 12 extra. Okay, so five food groups over here that have a surplus. Over here, we've got one, two, three, four, five already that have surplus because we concentrated on eggs. We did. Hunting camp, Gandalf, no storage. Where am I? Let's go take care of that one real quick. Um, Gandalf hunting. There. There. These trees are hitting it pretty well. Um, I thought we took out some of these trees. I think... No, they're not growing up yet. These are the ones that are kind of left over. We didn't plant these. They're just left over after the, uh, after the chopping. And I don't know if they ever finally grow up or if they're just smaller trees. You know, just for the looks. I'm not sure. You are z zero. You are 13. You are 28. And someone just brought a load out of you. So I think we're fine there. There's someone else grabbing some too. Okay. So those are fine. Um, yeah. We're going to think about that. We're in, we're in April. We are taking down berries over in here in Gimli. We're doing fine. We are needing an income source for Gimli. We're needing a manor in Gimli. You are 12 out of 40. Food over here, at the moment, it's eight months. I think while there's so few people here, another 20 berries is enough to add half a year to us. So that's not as impressive as it sounds. <laughs> but you guys, let's pull a family out because we're overwhelming the animals. We're down almost to our 10. So that gives us another family for building. We were building this monster lot over here. And built? What are we? Built. Okay. Tab. And we have a family in here. Let's get the... Can we? 15. That bankrupts us, but let's do it. Get you in there, get that going, and then we'll throw the the house in soon. There are no logs. That was a save. Every time it everything stalls before that save comes up, it, it worries me. I just my editing software tends to crash once in a while, and it does a quick little stall, and I go and my stomach just drops like, oh no, where did I save last? And so that's what it reminds me of when this gives that little pause. There's one family over here. I don't know where you are working. And again, the game does it not yet. I'm hoping they fix this someday. But when you click on this, I, I it would really be nice if it showed you. That's because we're working right over here. You know, to know where that uh, where that is. I'm assuming that's it. That's pretty uh, significant right there. Um, I could. I, I would like to see you guys clean up these trees laying down over here. Yeah. Um, let's look at fertility over here. You and Emmer. Wish Emmer was a key. Press E or something like that. Um, we're over here. So animals are roads. They're over here. So I don't dare get any closer here. But I would like to take these out and uh, one more time. Emmer. Just these. These. 
and then this whole corner out in here out that's a longer walk for them unfortunately you guys could let's just move you over there and get that cleared up for next for for uh, September so you are now going to work on at the very least these guys until they get a message we'll do that so you can take out those trees then we'll move you over into here firewood we have not been running firewood for a while and I do remember while I was editing seeing a warning that this guy was full it then relieved itself a little bit but let's go ahead and get this going so I need planks I need logs and planks uh, over here boy you guys are a long way away but most of the trees we wanted to take down were right over there um, planks 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 we do have a family we probably what we need is an assigned ox handler we need to get this guy done there's so many needs over here who are you guys you are market stall forager and forager why are you transporting your berries back that's the job of our market stall is it because you're full it's because you're full so the market stall is not relieving you enough so you're having to do it yourself which i don't think they did that before the update they would just sit there and, and twiddle their thumbs and do nothing now I've, I've noticed that in a couple other of the uh, of the buildings that they'll start delivering when their 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 uh, supply gets too full so if i need boy mm, i need someone to help get more logs in i need someone to run an ox permanently i need another market or granary person hmm we did pull somebody out of here the tannery is not running right now the hunting the second hunting is not running the woodcutter is not hunting uh fuel is still nine months we don't need them uh farm is empty there's really nowhere else i can i can steal somebody unless i took them out of here and that harms our market stalls so that's not an option and there's one there one there and there are three over here while this is growing though do i want to take any out i think at the beginning of each month there's a surge of growth until we're out of the growing season i think that's how it works so you want to take out as many of those 64 as you can if i'm correct i have to come back here 24 out of 64 let's try to remember to come back here in may and see if that saw a big burst a boost if it does then we'll leave all three here if it doesn't then although it doesn't do me any good if you're if you can't get them out of there okay well we did add one to the granary and hopefully that will help um, I could play with that one tactic that I hadn't realized was an option for me and for a few minutes if I sit here and babysit this you guys work exclusively right there for a while that's a great tactic if you remember to go back <laughs> otherwise you just messed your town up big time how you guys doing oh we just set that up okay um i would love to get a second house in there but what was the other thing we needed we needed to upgrade this we needed planks so where are we at zero planks and 24 lumber or uh, logs why do we have no planks hmm let's take you up to the highest let's get you built then let's get you out of there since there's 34 logs you're almost we'll get you out of here now you can be a builder let's get this built and get a family assigned to it and you can just run this system for a while okay um sam wise what was that last message this is may this is may i didn't catch that um that doesn't look right where is gimli right there you were at 23 you burst back up to 49 so it's not a full replacement but it is significant it is okay so there's a lot of growth and it didn't go to 64 so we haven't lost anything we didn't lose potential maybe it could have gone even more if we had used more of them up so i think we're in a good place there you are still waiting for somebody to wander over here you are a granary worker you're going to take the pressure off and you are too let's put that third family in and let's just capitalize on berries we'll do that you guys are going to relieve it real quick for another couple of months it's kind of like the month of getting these things done really quick for a couple of months let's get as many out of here as we possibly can family members join Genoff Genoff 
How come I never see this for Samwise? Or even here? I'm sure we just got another one. Does it say? Well, I mean, we're at 60%. So how are we doing here before we leave? These three have filled. These are being built. We have no... We may not have had one build. Hmm. Okay, we got to get one of these guys going. I did... I noticed as I was editing, I had turned you down. I bent, I thought there were three here, and I wanted to turn three and two down and leave one, but I ended up turning two and one down when I needed to get something else going. Probably that one. So you're next. That other stall of theirs next. I could put a family in here. It's just they're much further away. They'll have to come all the way out over here, do a log. They might go back. They started here. Maybe we'll get a few rounds. So this really is the one that I want to put a family in. And Gimli really is the place I need to put a lot of my effort into. Although we're, we're working hard over there in Gandalf trying to get up to three, uh, ten th tier three homes. How quickly are you going to do this? All the materials are here, right? Yeah. So you're here, you're just popping in a roof. And... And... A money source. We did get the trader up last time. It may not be built yet, but it's in place. So a money source. All right. So you, let's assign a family. And the one ox that belongs here is Jacob. Who? Where is Jacob? He is. He's a long way away. He's hauling a log to one of these houses over here. Okay. So somebody's going to be Jacob's permanent. Uh, um, what handler i guess handler works that is the church that's going to go in this is the trader that's going to go in and you are not the highest you are and you should be down here real soon hopefully somebody will move in as soon as that happens since we're we're in the positive territory okay i think i can leave there for a while gandalf has been doing lots of stuff over there samwise 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 Crops are looking great. Yeah, but we need that flax. So flax. We have been making flax. We... Joiner, we need a tailor over here. I think so. Monies, we are 53. We're not doing that great yet. Tailor over here. Because we have our flax over here. We have our weaver. Is that something we did? We did that over like here, right? Weaver shop, and we are doing it. So you guys are making linen already. Let's get a tailor in. You... It seems wise to put you right there. Okay. Tailor, you're in. And highest priority is to get you done. Let's start, let's start making gambesons over here. Um, no fires or lightning. Or what's even scarier, rubble. I, I learned that, that first fire that we had. We... Uh, it pretty much already determined we had no possible chance of saving that food stall so it just immediately called it rubble so if it starts off as rubble just give up it's not gonna happen um over here so we built you okay one two and you were three you you kind of look like you're done. Are you still, you're still chopping away at the ground over here. There it is, right there. Okay, so you're going to be number four out of ten. It's going to give us a lot room for a lot more families. That is. So most of our growth right now is going to be in tier threes. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five. So far. And have we successfully put in... You are now a level 2. Do I make you a tier 3 already? So what's the danger of having too many tier 3s too fast? We might not keep them satisfied. We have food variety now. Um, clothing stall. We only need two things. We have gobs of shoes and leather. So then we're starting to put in leather or linen now. And church. So really it's beer. Exposed stocks are getting wet in Gandalf. What does that mean? Forager's hut. We got stuff sitting outside in the forager's hut. Okay. Let's... Oh, that's right. Gotta remember... Where am I? Over here. Turn you off. Let's have you guys play that same tactic. Advanced. You guys move over to the forager's huts. Which are... Right in here. Clear those out. 
and that is you you're full and you aren't being used so take you two out put you two in oh that's a great tactic I've been using it for this it didn't dawn on me how powerful that really was you can stall off an oversupply that did, that wasn't a strike exposed goods okay so like over here let's just do it uh, right there let's put in a second one and you can be say right over here spin you around tuck you in like that perfect road you to there great and when this guy is too full and boy they didn't take out that much I was going to change the uh, the location of the granary workers efforts look at that rain coming down in sheets but they haven't really done the job yet does I probably have to get to the better granary in order to get a cart don't I I bet you there's no cart over here hmm Okay, um, I need stone and I need planks. Have we made a single plank? We've made six planks, so it actually, it is functioning now. Okay, planks are for the manor, planks are for upgrading this guy, and we need ten. Planks are for upgrading this guy, ten, and stone. Stone. I remember thinking about this, but I see we haven't built it yet. Four families are now building. Do we desperately need those four families anywhere else? I guess temporarily put one in there just to get the job done. But otherwise we'll leave the, the uh, builders to the three families. What? It still says four. Does someone move in just as? That's interesting. There were four. I clicked this and there's still four. What did I miss there? I don't know. You are Gimli exposed... Oh, families, unassigned families needed. And this says Gandalf. Oh, you did it to me again. Gimli, there we go. Okay, well, if you have the wrong information, you start making mistakes. Yeah. So there's only one family over here to build with. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Taylor shop is done. Let's move over there and turn you on to Gambison's, which it is doing. So we'll go through those until our little dudes have got... In fact, how are our little dudes on the other side? Oh, we're up to almost 30 again on our Spear Militia. And one of them has a Gambus. <laughs> All right, 32 of our pole arms, no archers, and none of them have Gambusons. And 32 in our pole arms, and none of them do. So we've made one Gambuson. One. Okay. Uh, well, we'll start making them in Samwise now. And... So Samwise, we have extra people. When I was editing last episode, I got a chance to spend more time thinking about what uh, what really happened there when I did this and saw the 66 of 36. So we have 30 extra people that aren't needed for, well, the, the only Samwise militia. So pull arms, there's 22. Let's get a pull arm militia started over here. That is right there. The pull arm militia Samwise. Boom. And now we don't have a surplus. We actually are six under what we need. 72. So that's what that means. I, uh, I had to scratch my head last time. It's always easier when I'm editing to sit back and watch what I was trying to figure out while I was recording. And then I get, it's like, you know, coughing it up and regurgitating the second time if you were a cow and really working it over and figuring out what you missed that first time yeah that is not the best analogy but uh, that's what popped into my head gandalf is okay construction unassigned okay so we did send these guys over here let's go clean up those messes before we continue on so there's five people over here and they're all running stalls and they're only cleaning out these at the moment how well have they done? You still 44. So that's not a great tactic because it, it does, it, it takes a long time to actually get them to do it even when you're focusing in like that. So I'm gonna go back to unassigned, clear the work area, and we're just gonna swap them out between buildings. So we kind of doing the same thing with that before right here. Four in there, four in there, and four in there. So we are good storage wise. 
and one family in each and this is built up again wow so i guess two back into two of them it leaves us two families to be doing other things okay so we're fine over here gimli we had done that too as well and has, has it done any good now there's been a little bit more time to walk over there you now we're still three or bringing them in just as fast as two families can haul them back out so that's not really working um yeah we just we just did it again pantry's full uh does it say it doesn't say and it went away okay um clothing stall samwise put in a clothing stall oh, we're over here in our first uh, first of, of the middle okay um two families how do we do this I need to get your built your built and you haven't filled yet let's make you the next priority then can you guys get over and quickly build this then instead of trying to haul it away we'll just swap you around and just through the middle of the season we can swap into the other one and that will be a good band-aid a good workaround trading post not the high priority we don't have much to trade we really don't um so and we just need what do we need to make a tier two uh here we need a church church level we need this we need stone right no church is right here we just need to build it okay that gives us tier twos which gives us our own tailor or our own um shoemaker uh, kind of thing give us a more variety something to sell that's what i'm thinking but we don't make a whole lot of a whole lot of me of leather where is it it's right in there somewhere 91 leather that would make quite a few shoes we of course have 1900 iron ore though i really hate to sell the iron ore that just feels like such a waste if you're gonna sell something sell i'll even hate to sell the iron slabs you really want to sell what you've made with the iron you really do we need that church in we need a blacksmith so let's get let's start preparing for that we need an iron mine we just don't have the families to build with but long term <laughs> we need an iron mine we need to clear the trees out of here okay did we get the two trees Wait, they haven't done a single one of them no we're over here they haven't done a single one of them really dudes what are you working on ah we took them out of the logging camp completely we just don't have enough families okay so how do we get more families we're at 71 percent we're almost at 75 we need to increase variety what does that mean so food stalls uh food marketplace here we go let's look at this fuel we're ahead by nine uh variety we have berries and vegetables and no and meat so if i can get a fourth one if i can get some chickens in we need money okay that's not going to happen all right so clothing we have nine leather so it comes down to probably a cobbler to get us over that 75 mark i think that's what it is so you're next you are the one down very high though boy you gotta get in there too because you're about to fill i have this month so next month that's gonna fill okay and there are no others no no reds okay so we need another house soon we need the church soon but first off we need this to get in and you still need one more log is there a log on its way you are a well that's got the log already you are probably on your way if you are and you are then it would be wise to get a shortcut into there yeah i can see that now uh, it doesn't have to connect to here, dude. You're still doing these. Interesting. Now we've got two oxen. You are Viet, and you are over here guiding an ox. So you're heading that way as well. Nobody's coming up over here. Hmm. I guess they got those orders first. Did I? I did set you to highest. I did. But they must have got those orders first okay we are maxed out on our berries we are and we got nowhere to put them 
Oh, that hurts. All right, take somebody out of there so that you guys can work with construction, I guess. Okay. I guess just setting the priorities. You're the second highest. You're the highest. You're, you're, yeah. It was actually said highest, right? Right there. There you are. Highest. Okay. And after that is this one. You are the next highest. So you're high. And then I need to get one more house in. And then I think we can work on the trading post and the this one. So you are a medium. Trading post is probably a medium. Yeah. And another house or two. So let's get that set. Uh, I think over here is pretty much where we want them. Though I'm going to need a road at this point. Or do I... Is that too far away f between roads? It feels like it is. I kind of wish I left a space here now. But how much more I can do about that. We never did get a fire from that lightning storm, right? We never did. At least that, nothing that I noticed. Okay. So let's quickly throw in a road here. And send you up into there for now. And you're doubles. You are doubles. I guess that's a quick and easy way. Though I kind of want to reserve the doubles. For... What's it cost to add a double? To add the other one, is it the same? Uh, right there, it adds two logs. So it's the same as putting in the, the first one. Okay. Maybe it's less construction time, but it's the same uh, load on our resources. So let's put a house in here. If I went to there, it gives us a tiny bit more than a, a full-size lot. There we go. We get a double out of it. And these can all just be artisans or eggs, chickens, what have you. All right, so that one is probably on a high. So you are going to be equivalent to the church because we're going to have used this last house by then. All right, so I think I can walk away from Gimli for a while. We're still at 8 and 11. Uh, food is coming in. and just It's just frustrating not to be able to get the full potential out of this. We're just not big enough to handle it. Where are we also hurting on that? You guys are doing fine. And we could use that second forager hut ID over here. Let's get that established. You there and there. That, yeah, I, I think that's a great idea. Just a, a backup one. You won't fit in there no matter what, will you? Because that road. Can I get you in here? No. Can I spin you and drop you down like that? Just the other side of it. And then tuck you backwards as far as you'll let me. Like that. And that puts a little road space right in between. We'll cut all the way through. Yeah, we'll do that. And that will, yeah, be able to work your way through whichever way that is. Not as pretty as this one, though. But I, it, it gets the job done. You guys are nearly full. You've got an upgraded uh, granary over here. Only three families work in it. There's not much to do over here food-wise. It's all right here. And seasonally, it's it's out over here. And what is left over here? We have hauled everything in. Okay. We really have. So, planks. Uh, we've hauled everything in. We can probably pull a family out of here. Like we're doing too good a job. I don't know. Um, that reminds me. Let's go ahead and get this one assigned. I think by now we have enough planks. So storehouse needs... Boy, that needs to be the highest priority, too. Once I set it. Um, do I wait just a little bit? No, we're constantly bringing in hides and then converting them to leather. We're going to keep adding to this all the time. Let's go ahead and do it. Upgrade. I need ten planks. We still have ten planks? Zero planks. What did we use the planks for? I thought we had six... Oh, I know what it was. It was saying Gandalf. It was saying Gandalf, and that's where I saw the six planks. That must be it. But there's a family here, and they haven't done a single thing in all this time. People, where are you? You're crafting and waiting. So you're just not getting logs in there. But we've been delivering logs to all those other projects. So maybe it's finally time to get the logs into here. Okay. So it's just it was just a long delay, because there were so many other jobs in the... The, in the queue. Yeah, we're, we're, see, we're witnessing it now. You guys are probably all finally getting over here. Gimli got a family to work on this now, too. 
So the log is in. Oh, thank goodness. So some of you guys are probably building. Uh, forager, unassigned constructing. Constructing, constructing. Okay. So you... Pantry is full in Gandalf. Forager's hut. And Gimli, new families moving in. All right. So Samwise, pantry is full. Forager's hut. Yeah, we... we Forager's hut. Forager's hut. Samwise. Oh, so Samwise Forager's hut. And in fact, we were just trying to solve that. So, well, here, max you out. And that was same thing over here? I think it was. So the berries are definitely doing their thing now. So you are maxed out. You are almost maxed out. So much for that plan. Oh, okay. Gonna have to just get these guys butts in gear and get the work done um so we've got well what do you do with this now you put one family back in here and just back off on this one i guess and hope that these guys start making the trip you're probably yeah you're one no you're a forager you're transporting berries you are a forager transporting berries you're trying to unload okay um gimli forager hut Okay, good. Good, good, good. So, two over here, and take two out of there. In fact, we'll put three in here. Three in here. And let's get some of these berries brought in. Okay, we're, we're up and running again. Alright, do we still not have any... We have five planks now. Thank goodness. And one more was rolled in, but we lost our ox. Yeah, you are not here, so it's not like you're taking a break. Well, we've got potentially 10 available, which means we get an upgrade of one of the two. You're the one that's needed the soonest. You don't need it except it may give us more capability. Might give It might give us carts or something like that. I don't know. Let me know if you know that. Storage house, I'm pretty sure there's... Is there one cart at the beginning? I know I've seen someone use a cart... From a storehouse when we were at level one. That was back in episode one, we saw that happen. So I think with level two, we get two carts. But where are the carts for the granary with three, with two families? So let's just follow all the lines. Do any of you have a cart? No. No. And no. Saving. Crash. Okay, you guys. No and no. So I don't know if there is a cart with level 1 granary. Is there a cart with level 2 granary? That's what I'm curious about. So you have your logs now. You're getting a log delivered. One of two, is that number one or is that now number two? Yes, now number two. So you're done delivering because that's the last plot we put in. So you're going to go back to fill up the planks now. Okay, good. Or you're going to go back to doing this. Unfortunately, I really need you guys taking those two trees out. Okay. Well, we got the forager's hut done. That was the most important. This one's got all of its logs, so it won't take long to do this one. You are the high priority. You are needed. Well, you're not needed until July. Okay. So we can go ahead and continue with the other plan, which was here. Very high. And you're high. Okay, so that's there. And let's change you to highest. So we can get that in. So we can get you to very high. So we can get to, I guess, you. Because you're, you'll go so quick. Oh, you are very high. Okay. You are the next one. Now, we'll stick to you. Then I want to get this going. So we can start getting stone in. So you're high. And once that's done, we'll get... Well, the church will be in. We can get a tailor... No, a cobbler, and we can start getting something to sell. So you then become high. All right, I think that's the plan over here. Back over here. Um, did we ever reset the granary? I went over here like three times to do it. So just to make sure that we're not... Okay, we did. You're no longer specialized for that one spot. You as well. Granary, advanced... Okay, clicked you off. Now you can go back to doing everyone. Do we have meat? We do have meat still coming in, and you're doing fine. Okay. And over here, do we have any of these dumped? 45 and 41. We're at least in business still. Okay. Though this is a 64, 62, we're still not able to. So I guess we need a third one. 
I guess we need three of these things to make this work. Wow. It, we, it took three to make the, uh, the meat work. So I guess we'll go with that. Still haven't come up with an answer here. And there is a work area not available, which is you guys. Okay. We had specialized you into like there and it seems like there is somewhere else. Um, let's look at that real quick. Uh, construction and Emmer. There's this area. Emmer, is there anywhere else on this in this province? No. So that is the only spot. So where do we want to take trees down now? Where would be advantageous for us? It'd be nice to be able to see the, uh, to find these guys. It really would. So let's have you, where are you? Right there. Advanced. Let's have you take out these trees right in front. I'd love to be able to find those things without having to go hunt for them. Same with you guys. Actually, kind of same with you guys. You're there and there. Okay, so let's bright, broaden you up a little bit. Go to there and go to there. Come down a little right in there. Take all those out for me. Thank you. Where am I at? 50-ish uh, minutes. Okay. Um, so we were doing what? We're in June. I don't think June means anything other than... No, we're still growing. It's July when the growth stops. Okay. Uh, 27 and 7. So can we... And that's 7 because we are making things with those planks. How are we doing on that? 17 large shields over and above what we need. We're not selling large shields. We are not transporting large shields because these guys are making their own now. So, and large shields are also used with the... The, um... Both of the platoons, both of the, the infantry, the... No, I take it back. They're not used with the Samwise pole. So it's only the spears. So we don't really need to be making any more of those. We could be selling them. Okay, so that helps. Let's give you guys something else to sell because we still have much money coming in. Trade... Actually, we already set that up. I went through... Remember that episode? It, it was excruciatingly long, but I went through and, and said, Okay, let's just export all these things when they pass by that number so are we doing it in general we have 22 large shields over here so people they're all waiting and guiding oxes why are they not trading that, that frustrates me at times I come in here and they don't seem to be doing anything in general so if I were to fire all of you and then bring two of you back people now you're all waiting um, hmm. Going home, guiding an ox, because you had nothing to do, so you just kind of volunteered to move logs around? Stocking goods for sale, but I want someone to say trading. Now, do we have two horses over here? Livestock. Why do we have no horses? I know I've clicked that button before. I know I have. One, two, but what did I just put in? You weren't added to it. Oh, you, oh. Okay, advanced. You're waiting. Let's get another horse over here. All right, that helps out. So you are working over here, right? One thing about having multiple provinces, when I see I've made a huge mistake somewhere, right there, you're all waiting. People, waiting, 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 stocking, stocking. Uh, one more waiting, transporting transporting so general nothing is stored inside why is that trade um so we have excess shields no tell you what hold on i'm going to take a couple minutes and set everything up through here that we may possibly ever want to export if we ever have it in stock well i've been sitting here thinking one thing that i wanted to do was to have a constant import of the things that we can't grow here in Gandalf. And that was too expensive to do when we had to pay the full tariff. So let's use that point. I want to explore and see what this is like. It's still gonna be expensive. The idea is to just bring in enough to top off our own supplies. And we'll still be bringing it in from the other provinces if we have to. But I think this is where I need to go. Food seems to be holding pretty steady now. We're not growing in huge bursts anymore. So I don't think I need to get into here or here. That would be 
variety, but with the eggs coming in, we do get quite a variety. And with this, we could even have wheat rolling in at, you know, just enough to maintain loaves of bread at a bare minimum. I'm going to go this route, and we'll get to see right now what that actually does. And I think that kind of finishes off our episode, doesn't it? So, trade, that was 12 to bring in barley. Now it's 7 to bring in barley. Okay. I'm going to set you up for import. I want to maintain... Um, Let's maintain 20 barley at all times. 20 or 10? That's going to get expensive. Let's maintain 10. As long as we still have it rolling in from um, Samwise, then it's not a problem. It will never get down below 10. They'll never make the purchase. When we do have a, a shortage and can't get it in here, then we at least have the ability to keep ale happening. I think import and... Do that as well right here. Um, 10 also. Flax, sure, we'll do the same thing. Import and 10. So it's going to be a long time before we actually buy any, though we will be buying wheat here real soon. We could buy wheat from Gimli. We could do that. Gimli's going to have some. They're going to need a little bit more variety over there, but they're going to have a lot of vegetables coming in. Let's keep that in-house, which means we should be buying at two when that actually happens so in-house will be Gimli and we'll set the trade over there for that but I think that is what we need to do and there'll be we could almost what's it cost to bring in some of these other things we don't have yet if we wanted to bring in Gamesons a little bit quicker just out of curiosity uh, Gamesons well it's, it's not going to tell me till I yeah it was N-A-N-A -A. so it, it's a guess right now Okay, but I think I'm at that near hour mark. We figured out the point, and we've got... Am I, I am paused. I'm uh, sorry, I paused it when I was working on that. We've got one, two, three, four, five tier threes now, and don't have a lot of workers trying to bring the other ones up, but otherwise we're, yeah, we're at five, and we have enough tier twos now to finish off the five more needed tier threes. Do we just boom, 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 boom? I mean, that was the idea. Well, never mind. We don't have any planks. So this was the place where we had only six planks. Yeah. Yeah, the Gandalf one was showing over Gimli. So we've turned these guys off because we were running out of logs. There's four logs sitting over there. There's five logs over there. Only one person left. And logs over in the system are 22. Hmm. Okay. It's still going to be a trickle. Okay, so that's over there. Anything real important over here? We got the tailor going. We got the gamisons going. Um, you guys got a new place to put to, to get logs from. We got two in there. We got one in here. We are way overloaded. Turn you off. We need to find a place to start, or a way to start using these planks up. So that's the joiner is making you guys, and we have enough to sell now. Let's start making something over here to sell. So you guys start doing that with planks. Okay, and Gimli, anything last? Gimli, 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 over here. Anything last to see or do or think about over here? You, our pantry is full still. So you are 50 and you are 49. People, I, I can't get them to empty them. And we're running out of our growth season. Oh, that's frustrating. There's one in each. And you're just not doing anything. That's a shame. All right, did we ever get enough planks? I'm turned around. I am really turned around. Gimli, you're over here. Gimli. Okay, one more time. 49, 41. Okay, put a family in there. Take a family out of here. Uh, pantry, forager, yeah, you're full. Out of there. Do I take you? Let's take you out as well. Okay, can I add you to the, to here, to here? I guess that's about all I can do. And you, let's go ahead and upgrade you. Upgrade you and take you to the highest priority and just get that done. We got our extra house in. We did not tab. We did not. You, highest priority and get you done too before July hits. We're starting to work over here. We did get, oh, we get almost all the materials there. 
Okay, so they're almost ready to do that one too. Let's call this one done, and we'll just continue the uh, the battle next time. Thanks for watching, folks. Bye bye. <laughs>